Edward Marlowe is a phenomenon who has unquestionably made an indelible mark in the world of magic. In the past 40 years, he has published numerous innovative and influential books, plus an impressive number of articles for various magazines. The complete Marlowe bibliography is still incomplete, but at last count, there are over 1,500 items covering 3,200 pages of text and over 57 books. Over and above this remarkable prolificacy is the consistent superiority of the material itself, and all of it chronicles his long, ardent, and fastidious love affair with the pasteboards. Edward Marlowe, The Legend. Right there? Right there. All right. Now, what I want you to do is I want you to take your hand and put it over your packet like that, and I'll put my hand over this packet, okay? Now, the object is to cause the card you're thinking of to come under my hand. You just snap the fingers. Now, what card were you thinking of? Jack of clubs. See if it's still there. It's gone. Let, let me see it, because I can't see it. What was the card? Jack of clubs. The jack of clubs. Four aces and the four of clubs. The one, two, three, four aces are marked off by the four of clubs. Now, what we're going to do is uh, cut the aces into the center like that. Now they're not on top, or the, and you know they're not on the bottom. The object is to deal out five hands of poker. One, two, three, four, and the ace from the middle. One, two, three, four, and the ace from the middle. Two, three, four, and the ace from the middle. One, two, three, four, and the ace from the middle. That leaves me one card in the center yet, which is the four. And naturally, these are the four aces. We have uh, 26 black cards and 26 red cards. And we're gonna do a pharaoh, and as you know, a pharaoh shuffle alternates the cards, red, black, red, black. i make sure you get the perfect split here. Now wait a while, I better square this off. Need a little more light here, so we'll just do this. There we are. And now, like that. Now that alternates the cards, red, black, red, black. Well, it does for everybody except me. In my case, they remain black, and they remain red. So they may alternate for everybody else, but not for me. Now for this, we use four aces. They go on the bottom of the pack. Then the cards are cut to put the aces in the center. And now we're going to do a center deal. That's one, two, three, four, and five. That's an ace. One, two, three four and five, that's an ace. One, two, three, four, and five, that's an ace. And one, two, three, four, and five, and that's an ace. Four aces from the center of the pack. Guys, are shuffled, and then I ask you to think of a number from one to 10, but don't tell me till I come to it, till we come to it, you understand? Have you got a number from one to 10? All right, now, did you think of number one? No. You didn't think of number one, all right. Did you think of number two? No. You didn't think of number two. Did you think of number three? No. You didn't think of number three. Did you think of number four? No. You didn't think of number four. Did you think of number five? Yes. And that's the ace of spades trick. He did it to me again. <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> this version of the ace of spades trick, the cards are shuffled. Not only that, the spectator gets to cut the cards. How about that? And then I right where he cut, See, right where he cut, we'll use that port. No, this is right where he cut, we'll use this. <laughs> I don't want to. We, we all raised that high off of it. Now, this is, I tell you beforehand, this is the ace of space tree. Do you want this card here? No. You don't want that card here. Do you want this card here? No. Uh, do you want this one? No. Do you want this card? No. Do you want this one? No. Do you want yes. this one? Do you want to change your mind? No, I'm satisfied. That's the ace of space tree. <laughs>